Josh sure, Robertson, yes. yeah, Josh Robertson is live in Golden Meadow there for us. Yeah, hey Lee, hey Meg, and, and hopefully Bruce, I was hoping to get him real quick, and, and I know I actually just heard from Zach also because I wanted to stay in the car first to be, to be able to hear to kind of understand um, what we might be able to expect here in the next 20, 30 minutes, maybe even an hour. Rob Krieger is this direction, okay? I'm in, I'm in Lafouche Parish right now. He's in Terrebonne, so he's to the west of me right now experiencing all of that that you just saw uh, if you've been watching and I've been listening to. I haven't been able to see it, so I don't know what exactly, but just hearing you guys describe it, it seems pretty epic. Now, here where we are, we're right on the other side, on, probably I would say on the wrong side of, of the floodgate, and if you're ready, Jay, we can just hop out. We're just going to get out because... All right, and uh, we're expecting these conditions to probably get worse here in a second. I was told by Zach, we're kind of on the outer bands right now. We could be getting close uh, a little bit, having the eye wall maybe move a little bit closer to us. And again, we're in Lafouche Parish. This is Bayou Lafouche right here. And we've been seeing the wind start to pick up just a little bit, uh, just, just a little bit here. We're getting, hold on. They've been kind of getting worse and worse. Just listen, we've been sitting in the car probably at 30, 40 minutes and the winds have been picking up, actually kind of moving the car every now and then, just kind of, I won't say moving, but kind of rocking it a little bit back and forth. Uh, and again, as I was saying, we're here to the east in Lafouche Parish and seeing winds pick up and get to, and the conditions deteriorate. And Rob Krieger is that way somewhere in Terrebonne Parish. If you just look over, he's that direction, obviously in the parish next to us to the west and he's experiencing all of what you just saw and I think right now we're going to start to see these conditions get a little bit worse here uh, in Lafouche Parish and then again the bayou right now we're right here at the floodgate if you want to look on the wrong side of the floodgate but as I told you guys I, we can get on the right side very quickly we're right here uh, we're, we're in a safe spot nothing really uh, flying towards us anything like that uh, at this point but I know just listening to Zach, uh, I spoke with Zach a second ago. I know he said that all of this is going to deteriorate. These winds, all this stuff is going to start heading towards places like La Rose. It's going to keep going up north. It's going to go to places like La Rose. It's going to go up towards Raceland, Matthews, Galliano, all of that, uh, which is north of here. Uh, but again, we're right here at this boat launch just uh, outside the levee protection system right now. And we're seeing conditions, mainly the wind, get worse and worse here uh, as we know this. Francine now starting to make landfall uh, here in the area. So uh, we're going to stay here. We're going to see if it you know, gets worse or better. I'm predicting, I think, worse uh, than what we're experiencing right now, which, you know, Rob Krieger mentioned it. The rain has not really bothered us all day. We've been getting wet. But at this point, when the wind's blowing like this, every every raindrop is just like it's just like getting just getting pinched in your ears and your face and all of that stuff. So it's no fun at all. I will say the good news is that we haven't seen anybody out here pretty much all day long, which means they've been heeding those warnings. The only people we've seen really is police officers, sheriff's deputies, uh, uh, Louisiana State Police, Harbor Police, things like that. We've been keeping up with the parish officials here in Lafouche also. And uh, obviously you should be hunkering down if you're not us, but this is why we do this so you can kind of get an idea of what this is like. But you can go down there a little bit further, Jake. and. And just kind of see, you know, what what Bayou Lafouche is doing right now, and and it's probably going to start going over Highway One. I would be willing to bet here pretty soon, and this wind is going to um, keep getting a little bit worse uh, as we go here. And we can send it back to you now. We'll stay. Yeah, we'll, we'll stay here and see how much worse it gets. Uh, but obviously you're seeing definitely deteriorating conditions. We weren't sure if we were going to experience this in our area here this morning uh, whenever it was just kind of raining. Uh, but the wind's definitely getting worse and worse. We'll send it to you now uh, back in the studio. And uh, if you talk to me guys right here, I can't really hear. I'd have to get back in the car uh, to, to hear anything you're saying. I'm sorry. All right, Josh Robertson down there. And uh, he is in Golden Meadow. and. Uh, while Josh goes back in the car, hopefully he will, uh, I want to kind of explain what he is going to see.